There will be times when having made entries into your time study area here, you have to make some changes. And uh, that can actually be quite easily accomplished for the value added, the delays, the rating, and the uh, add to last and suppression options here. And the way it's done is simply by clicking on the appropriate column. So let's say the buff sides, we wanted to rate one of these as different rating. We can click right on the rating value here. And it pops up these uh, options here. So we could say this is the buff sides, and let's say that was actually, you want to rate that at 110 perhaps, right? And you can say apply, and it will change these data observation. If I wanted to change them all though, I could say buff bottom. So let's say I felt it was always working at 95 in the buff bottom. I can select that, and it's checked here, right? And I say apply to all. And you'll see everywhere in here, it changes the rating here. Uh, so you can make n numerous changes like this. For instance, you want to change the <coughs> the buff bottom to required non-value added. So you can just click on any one of them. Select required non-value added. It checks it here for you. You can make multiple changes at the same time as well. Apply to them all. It will change it everywhere here. Plus change it down here in your uh, in your activity rating here. If you want to maybe suppress an observation that you've looked at. right? So what you can do is just click on one of the columns here. So buff says you want to suppress that click on the suppress here and then click on the apply and it will put the S in here and that would be excluded from your final calculation so using this little screen here it makes it easy for you to make changes to rating, value added, flags, delays and the add to last and the, uh, and the suppression capabilities within the package